Willa Rat Coat Sewers. So today I'm just going to be talking a little bit about how to attach your coat together um, at the seam allowances along the neckline and shoulders. Right now Willa is pretty much just a bag, so you could wear her, but she has a lot of movement in her because she's not attached anywhere, so your collar will move around a lot. So to prevent that we can just pop some stitches into our seam allowances along the neckline and at our shoulders to keep your lining and your um, coat outer uh, together. Alright so Willa isn't attached at the bottom yet so we can open her up and bring her down. And you can just see here where the back neckline is for your outer coat and your back neckline is for your um, lining. And all we're going to do is line up our seam allowances and I just run a set of stitches from one side just through to the other within your seam allowance. I'll just show you a close-up of that. Alright, I've gone ahead and stitched my back neckline seam allowances together and if you remember, right at the start I could pull my coat apart I can't do that anymore. It's all nicely attached, which means that when you wear it, your collar isn't going to move around. Um, if you are like me and have a really thick fabric and your machine is struggling to get through all of the layers of your seam allowance, um, you can just pop a few hand stitches in. It doesn't have to look pretty, you won't see it, so don't worry about that. Um, and the next thing we can do is the same thing to the shoulders. Um, this will help prevent the, the top of your lining drooping down along your sleeve. So we've attached the, the seam allowances at the bottom sleeve if you were watching that video on um, attaching sleeves. Um, but popping a few wee hand stitches into your seam allowances at the top of your um, shoulder line will also help to prevent the top of your lining popping down because we don't have a stitched hem in our sleeves and so it can droop down like that. At the bottom it can't because we attach our seam allowances but it can at the top here and we don't have another seam allowance to attach our lining to. So doing that at the top of your arm side will um, prevent some of that droop happening and then you can do some hand tacks along your neckline, uh, your, sorry, your shoulder line as well. Again, they don't have to look pretty. You can do them in any colour thread you like. Um, it's just to keep everything inside your coat secure. <laughs> 